So what do you think of the Typhoon H uh, camera? It's getting pretty good, isn't it? Unique is adding all sorts of new features and whatnot, but one thing that is still a problem on the Typhoon H is if you leave it in auto mode and record. So in this video, I'm gonna show you really quickly how to set your white balance and your shutter speed and get some really amazing shots. Check it out. When you first turn on the ST16 and the Typhoon H, and the camera connects, the camera will be in auto white balance. Nine times out of 10, it will display the correct white balance as can be seen in this image. So it would be best to actually lock in the white balance at this point. However, if you select a different white balance as I'm doing here on the screen, and you wish to return to auto white balance, well, guess what? The auto white balance will now be incorrect. Have a look at the fence. The fence is now blue. To fix this, you have to go into camera settings and select reset camera. The correct auto white balance settings will then be restored. If in doubt, always select sunrise sunset as your white balance. Your videos will always look great. A great video starts with a great exposure. Here's how to do it. First select the small red auto icon and then select the large red upper left auto icon. You will now see the letter M in the upper left and your screen may turn white. Always leave the ISO at 100. The only time you want to change it to a higher number is when it's late evening. On most sunny days, you're going to set the shutter speed anywhere from 1 500th of a second all the way up to 1 800th of a second. So there you go. If you lock in the white balance and if you set your ISO and you set your shutter speed, uh, everything should be pretty good. You should get some really decent uh, footage, video footage especially. Just to show you how good the Typhoon H is, I'm going to show you some video clips that I've taken over the last two months. Every video clip you're about to see, the settings were all in manual mode. And more importantly, I haven't done any processing to the video. It is all was all shot in gorgeous mode. So everything is straight out of the camera and here it is. Enjoy.